Where are we going? To sign the papers with the notary. Don't sound so excited. Scared. Yeah, yesterday we did our down payment. That was the first scary thing, not the first. One of the big scary things in this process. And today we're signing the papers. We signed a lot of papers, but these are the papers. So we're meeting them at Panera, the notary person, and- You don't have a colored hat? We don't have <laughs> I asked on the phone yesterday when we were setting up the appointment, how will the notary person know who we are? Should we wear a colored hat or something? I don't know why I thought that was the funniest thing in the world and Chris had to finish the conversation for me. But no colored hat today, no rose in a book. We're just gonna text them and say, hey, yeah, we're right here. I'm boring. This is awesome. But we like, um, we have, her, her mom uh, bought us the polar. so pretty in our very messy apartment full of boxes just a little reminder that it's gonna be great We just like got off of work. I'm still in work mode, but we're going. And shit's happening. What's that email, babe? Oh, <laughs> it's congratulating us on closing. Got our close an email. It's like responding to emails for work and then getting these humongous, you know, huge news emails from our lender and our realtor. We did it, we're homeowners. Crazy. That's weird. So now we have to finish up this work day. I have a very busy work day. <sighs> and then we wait to hear when we get our keys, what time we can get, o get over there. So today's Tuesday, August 16th. And then my dad is coming on Friday. So we're gonna like clean and prep the place for like renovating before he gets here. And there's just so much to do. But today we celebrate and we soak it all in. I don't know how I'm supposed to work right now. What about you? I don't either. Gotta go back to work now. Bye. Killing time as we wait to get the keys. Waiting for our um, realtor to get there. Apparently it just closed, so we are like locked in. Things we're, are happening. We're officially homeowners. We're officially homeowners. We're just waiting. Just to, no keys. We're just no keys. We're, we're just waiting for the keys. Killing time. We just got off of work, so we're hanging out at the nearby park, and um, we're gonna go get some Taco Bell tacos. Cause you know we have to save money now that we spent a lot of our money. It's fate. Take me home to home. <laughs> Take me home to our new condo. Why is that not working? Okay. Well. Secret. Was that ever working? It was. It it took a sometimes it took a while to like should I leave this open? Sure. Here it is. Our little fixer upper. It's very chilly in here. 
Man, that's so crazy. Our little fixer upper. All right, where's the, the air freshener? Yeah, unplug that air freshener. I wonder what's going on with that. I don't know. From our realtor. <laughs> we did it. We did it. Yeah, we just a uh, little, little concerning about this light here, but we'll figure it out. Hopefully. We did it. We did it. We're in. We're in. We have a lot of work to do. But tonight we relax and celebrate. Mm -hmm. And FaceTime our family right now. Mm -hmm. Are you ready? Do you have a knife? Oh. No. Did you see the sanitizer maybe? Dude, you didn't even get the raspberry in there. Look how big that cookie is. Of course, you go for the chocolate. Oh, it looks nice. Day two ish of being homeowners. We are inside taking measurements, not measurements, we're dropping shit off, dropping shit off and um, slightly getting organized and getting ready to clean tomorrow. Tomorrow's our deep clean day before my dad gets here and then we like paint and put everything in and all that. So today we're just bringing stuff over. We still have to bring the ladder over and get yeah. paint samples chandelier. and the chandelier, um, which we can bring over anytime. Mm -hmm. But we just needed to get in here and do something today because we don't want to waste this day. So now we're gonna go back and clean the apartment because my dad is coming and staying with us on our couch and it's filthy because we've been packing and stuff. So my dad is like Mr. Clean and he's, he's just clean. he's just very um he's just very clean. So we wanna clean a little bit. So he's not ashamed. Um Oh he's gonna be ashamed. He's gonna be ashamed. He sees the car. Oh yeah. He's gonna hate seeing the car dirty. He's gonna be like, Can we can we go wash your car while I'm here? Like let's just let's just go to a car wash and I'll clean it up for you. So I can see it now though. Do, do you feel better today? Yesterday I was like kind of nervous, but today mm -hmm. seeing all the hardware and stuff. I think you're you're stressed with work today. I was stressed with work yesterday. I was stressed with work today, but I, I don't care. This is important. It doesn't go down all the way. The mm -hmm. inspector said that. So yeah, we're gonna head back and uh, call it a day. Well, and here. we're gonna clean, yeah. Call it a day here. But we're excited. I'm excited. Are you excited? I'm excited. I'm ready. I'm ready too. I wish we could stay and just get started. Mm -hmm. All right, here we go. Just don't get me like not wearing goggles and safety stuff. Well, you're not, like you're, you're, not, you're not wearing gloves either, so. Demo day. I am currently trying to take off this bathroom backsplash, and it is a real bee. Getting creative, but it's really gross. So we really hope we can get it off, because we need to. It needs to be done. We got Chris paint, painting, not painting, cleaning the ceiling. Watch out for the paint that's on the wall. We have paint samples drying, and you can't even see them. It looks like exactly the same as the paint that's here. There's one, there's the other. We're leaning towards that one, but don't know yet. Um, we did like little samples on every wall. Here's another one. There's that one and that one. It's hard to tell though, because this place is pretty dark. And also, like you can't even see them. I think 
there and there. Um, the lighting is all getting swapped out, so it's kind of hard to pick one when this lighting isn't really here to stay. So, yeah, we have one that's more on like a grayish side and one that's more like pink. And I'm definitely leaning towards the non-pink option. But who's, I don't know, I don't know. And look, we have to like sand down these little bubble things, gross. But I feel very accomplished for getting this little chunk off. Look at that. Now I just gotta do 50,000 more. But at least we know what it looks like beneath, uh, bleh, behind it. So, I'm tired, we've only worked for two hours. My back hurts. It's gonna be a long weekend, but I'm having fun. I really enjoy taking off backsplash. It's very satisfying. It's very loud, but it's very annoying, but it's very satisfying. Good health is a worthwhile pursuit. Cool. So don't hurt yourself this weekend, basically. Oh. You have a fine capacity for the enjoyment of life. Like mm. taking out the backsplash. No. Nice. Clean. Mm. Not looking forward to touching this part of the condo, but <sighs> it's so dirty. I don't think it's ever been cleaned. Look at the yellow here. And then I'm gonna remove the shelf liner and we're gonna just repaint everything and clean it all out. It's so gross. So gross in here. Probably gonna have to sand this down. So I'm just putting it back for now. The official end of day one. Took off the medicine cabinet, that's gonna become a shelf. I started sanding down the um, backsplash of the bathroom, got all of that removed. Gonna do that tomorrow, but it's so loud. So I'm gonna break it up so the neighbors don't hate us too much. I feel gross, um, but good. I took down this closet door because it was just, shake took out that little towel hanger thingy took down the shower uh what's it called curtain rod um we started cleaning the inside of the closet we took out all of the light switch thingies to prep to prep for paint we took out all the doorknobs um took down the pole so we could uh so we could paint it Clean this a little bit, but we're gonna prime it and paint it, so it, I don't think it needs to be that clean. Doorknob. Clean the closet, took all the switches off. Gotta take bath off still. And then we took down this closet, which is gonna be Celie's litter box closet. There's her chandelier waiting to be hung. So we're gonna hang a curtain rod on the inside of this closet and a nice thick curtain. We tested some paint, even though it looks kind of like the paint that we already have in here, but like a cleaner version. There and there. Chris painted the ones on the left. I painted the ones on the right. I think we're gonna go with the one that I painted because it's just more of a neutral, warm white. And I'm tired. So my dad flies in at 10. It is now seven. So we might get some groceries and then Head back and relax before we go get them. Oh, I'm so tired. Day one. It was a good day. I think we got everything that we wanted to get done, done. Like this was a really good start. I think tomorrow we can get a lot, a lot, a lot done and get going on painting. Yeah. So bad. Z71 black carpet just pulled in. Yep. Should we pull in in front of it? Hold on. 
that one. Oh, I see. see, the truck. I see. Come on, out there. Eleven forty-five. <laughs> I would get out, but I'm in my pajamas. Don't even worry about it. <laughs> oh. oh. Hey, Hi. Hi. Eleven forty-five. That's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Who is that? Yeah, that sounds good actually. You want a sparkling water or you just want a cup of water? Can't wait to get a kitchen table because this ain't working. <laughs> Our little tiny table. Chris made breakfast. Thank you. Yeah, thank you. Mm -hmm. Very good. And cold brew. Yep. And we got about six hours of sleep. <laughs> it's Chip. It might be down the next one. We already looked down that one, didn't we? Hello. <laughs> yeah. Beforehand. Now we're going to Lowe's to see if they have a shop back. Yeah. Eating lunch, just made sandwiches. Place is a mess. Just got back from Home Depot. He's gonna organize all the tools and then start putting up some holes and stuff. Um, I gotta take off all the tile in the bathroom, gotta finish that. But we're trying to figure out the lighting because it looks very blue, but it's also very nice. But then I really had my eye on like warm lights. So I don't know if we should do warm lights. So it's all a learning lesson. And then we decided we're gonna take out the baseboards, current baseboards, because we're gonna replace all of them. But we were gonna have the flooring people do it, but we decided to remove it now so that we can paint it. And then we'll just do touch-ups because the wall might be all messed up depending on the size of the baseboards. So we're just getting organized. Our sh there's just shit everywhere. And we gotta figure out what to do and the order of doing it, so. song in the playlist was our song. That's a sign if I ever knew one.
blue. What do you do that for? It's high in there. Oh. How do you know how much to use? How much to use? Usually a strip across the top. Okay. You want to put too much because then it dries too fast on you and you won't get the job done. And you're, it dries in 15 minutes. That smell reminds me of like oh, no. your shop and <laughs> all the things growing up. Tripping. <laughs> can I do this one? This is sloppy. I can get sloppy because the floors are getting replaced. Yeah. So tightened these things because this thing was like way up. I don't know how that is so messed up. We are definitely getting a new vanity. This thing is destroyed. This is how I do things. This is my demo. <laughs> and we definitely need one that has the sink. So hopefully the one tomorrow fits. I feel like we should just pick it up today. Get the U-Haul truck. We so then tomorrow we could just move things along. I don't know if we'll need a U-Haul. I think we could stick it in the trunk. No, it won't fit. It won't fit. Loud. It needs some exhaust buddy. We got one can of paint. We're gonna test it out on one room to see if we like it before we like commit to buying three. Yeah, look how cool that house is. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, you have a little food truck over there. Yeah. Oh. What are you laughing at? You. Why? You're waiting for what? I was waving. Waving at what? You. Oh. You my darky. Now we're doing Home Depot trip number two for this weekend. Or no, Lowe's. We're doing Lowe's because Home Depot didn't have everything. I'm tired. My back hurts and my feet hurt. What about you? Your knees? Knees. Oh, you're, I thought you were I'm talking about you. Oh, yeah, my knees. What about you? What's in pain? And I'm hungry. What's in pain? Just my feet. Your feet, my feet yeah. Hurt. My feet hurt they too. They always hurt though. Yep. That's oh, nothing shit. new. Oh, shit. Yep. Here it comes. <laughs> a little dirty. A little smelly. Why does it smell like like a gym? It stinks. It's really gross. It stinks. That's really disgusting. Yes. Wait, should we like put that? Against you something. Want to put it? Um, I'll drive with you. Hang on, let me see if it smells. That's fine. I'll deal. Go ahead. Oh my god, this is so gross. Oh, it smells like like a like a sweaty sock and like cologne. And like, should have a ticker of how many times we went to Home Depot. This weekend. Yeah. This is number what, four? Now, do you sand it down and then you go over again and texturize it? Mm -hmm. Cool. Nice. Well, it's easy. Yeah, it's not too hard. Did I just use yours? Yeah, you did. Yeah. 
come down there like this. And that's just to make it stick on there, right? Can it stay? Just kind of smoosh it on there a little bit. Day two recap. Day two recap. Day one. Day officially day one. But last night I got in late. Between Chris and I, we've had like one half of a day. So it's like day one and a half. Patched up that and that. Chris has been painting the ceiling. I've been painting that wall and like half of this wall. And then my dad's been patching up any cracks and stuff. Um, trying out some texturizing. He's touching up the top right now. Shit's everywhere. Taking off the curtain or the blinds and putting up the holes. We took off all of the baseboards. And I vacuumed that and now it looks like shit. <laughs> um, took out the vanity, took out all the baseboard, puttied up, be, did, we're beginning to putty up the um, backsplash tile. We've removed all this and found out that we need to get a plumber because it's awful. Found out that this looks like shit, but whatever, the flooring people can deal with that. Found out that we need to cut into this uh, baseboard what is this called? The door frame. We picked up the vanity using the U-Haul. Took out all of the doorknobs. Um, my dad puttied up the holes in that and he puttied up a bunch of holes in here that we have to texturize tomorrow. Took out all the hardware. Um, took out the baseboards, took out the caulking layer. My dad pulled this out. Probably gonna put it in the garage so we can get the flooring done and not pay $200 for them to remove it. Um, we need to figure that out still. Didn't really do much in the bedrooms. I don't think we did anything in the bedrooms except take the, take the baseboards out and the curtains. But yeah, we're um, starting the painting process. And then everything else should uh, come together after painting. But it's looking good already. A little hack, if you don't want to wash your brushes and you're not done painting, you cover them with plastic wrap and you put them in the fridge. I've never tried it, but apparently it works. So we're gonna try it and see how it goes tomorrow. How many times did I use your paint instead of mine tonight? About two or three times. Two or three times. <laughs> and, then, yep. and then she blamed me. Yep. <laughs> how dare you put your thingy near my thingy. Yeah. And then I had to repaint like a little part of this wall and a big part of, yeah. of this wall. 